Hi there and welcome to this episode of Fishing with Jim and today we're back on the rock point again it's a very windy afternoon and uh, so a lot of the audio is going to be um, very noisy so it'll probably be a voiceover if I catch fish uh, but hopefully uh, the place is still fishing particularly well still using pilchards and a dropper bait system so looking forward to catching some more large snapper darker the fishing gets better and better catching pink snapper chirelli kawai snapper are a fantastic fish to catch. They come into the bay during the warmer months to breed, they're voracious eaters and they're a fantastic fish to eat. see a large black shape coming to the surface with a big fin. I'm momentarily stunned until I realize it's actually a pot of orcas surfacing. 25 feet of the rocks! <laughs> yeah! Two orca, uh, um, orca and, a, and a baby. Literally just came up. It's like, <laughs> oh my god. Um, yeah, well I guess I'll see them in a minute. There they go. Wow. That's, um, yeah. There's a whole pot of them. Wow, that's amazing. Um, there's about four of them. Yeah. Oh, oh and I've got a big fish on. <laughs> oh my god, it's all hanging. It's all happening. <laughs> I, I am filming it. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I've got to go. Well, orcas, amazing. Right, and I've got a fish on. It's all happening. Oh, this is a bit of fish, this one, I think. Came off, gutted. <sighs> Where are those orcas? It wasn't long before I hooked into another great fish. Right, hopefully we can actually land this one. So this is a good size snapper. Come on, baby. Oh yeah. That's what we're talking about. Another beautiful snapper. Check out that fish. That's awesome. Oh, 
and caught on the keeper hook again. Wow, that's pretty amazing. A little hook for a big fish. I'd caught some nice fish and it was time to call it quits and head back. Wow, what a great fishing session. Awesome to catch those large pink snapper and I couldn't believe my eyes when I saw the orca come in only 25 feet from where I was fishing. It was a great fishing experience. What's your favourite rock fishing spot? Have you got a wee spot at home that you love fishing from? And does it produce lots of fish? I'd love to know if you've got a favourite spot. You don't have to tell me where it is, but uh, if you've got a spot that you love to fish, leave your comments below. And if this is your first time to fishing with Jim, then I invite you to subscribe for more fishing action and fishing adventures. Thanks for watching Fishing with Jim.